Neil, that was an excellent first, uh, <laughs> an excellent result after a difficult first half. Yeah, well, we knew um, um, that Strictly liked to to play down the hill second half, um, with the camera the win behind them. So obviously we won the toss, and the first thing we did, we try and turn them round because we thought, you know, hopefully second half we could get a bit of momentum up and and push them, um, and you know, hopefully we we caused them a lot of problems. But yeah, first half, you know, we've had the ball in the net. Um, I, thought, I don't know what this allowed for. We've had the ball in the net many times. Um, you know, all cancelled out, but. Yeah, all in all, very difficult place to come has been proven by other teams. You know, their lads were up for it today. I thought their nine has done, done very well for the South, like the South, um, caused us a few problems. But I thought, particularly first half, I thought defensively we were very strong. You know, organised, um, done very well. You know, as you say, difficult. I think the only, the only thing we didn't have here this afternoon was snow. Mm -hmm. What What did you say to them at, at uh, half time? Because they, they they came out sort of, uh, you know, really looking looking to go for it, didn't they? That was always the plan. You know, I, I, I mean, we've, we've got to. Taking into consideration, there was quite a breeze coming down. You know, it was a bit of a slope. Um, you know, we knew we were going to have to sit in a little bit first half and, and defend. But we won the toss. If not, you know, we had the plan B for, for, to come out and attack. Second half, we, we just said we just got to stay together, keep going. Um, chances will come our way when we get them. We've got to take them. Um, and I think, you know, all in all, you know, apart from a, a sloppy um, defensive error for their goal, you know, all in all, we've, we've done very well. Mm -hmm. uh, you said the, the goal disallowed um, from George ran in the, in the first half. I mean, it looked okay to us. What did George have to say about it? George has no issues, no issues in the linesman. If you look at the linesman on this side, he's ran up the line. He's looking right at it. Um, but you can't, you know, um, goalkeepers these days, he's coming, for, for, as far as I'm saying, he's coming, he's got the wrong side of the ball. Because if you look at it, he's, he's catching it backwards into his net. Um, but, you know, we're not. We're not um, we're quite used to being I've got goals this allowed, aren't we? So yeah. no change there. Yeah. What do you think is the most uh, satisfying aspect of the game for you? I thought we defended superbly first half. You know they're, they're a big strong side and they, they play to their strengths and they put a lot of balls on top of our back four and George and Tails won a lot of headers. I thought Christian Smith was outstanding in midfield, breaking the game up, winning headers, getting into good positions to defend for us. Uh, you know, and we and we battled hard. I think you, when you come to places like this, you've got to put in performances like that. You know, you've got to, people will probably say, "Why haven't we played Coxy?" Well, you can't. You know, trying to get Coxy the ball would have been would have been um, hard enough work. Um, you've got to play certain ways at, at certain grounds um, against certain teams who, who play to their strengths, and that's what we've done. We've we've come here. Um, as I say, you know, the, the victory here shouldn't be understated because apart, as I say, apart from. The defensive lapse of the goal, you know, I think the lads have been excellent. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. You must also have been pleased with uh, Chris Sims' contribution to the first two goals as well. Yeah, Chris has done well. Chris has come back in, he's done well. You know, still got to be on his case a little bit to, to play more to the, the way I wanted to play in behind. Um, but yeah, Chris has done well. But, you know, I thought Christian Smith, as I say, was, was outstanding. But, you know, great contribution from the substitute team. Howard, he hasn't been involved for the last few weeks. Um, comes off the bench, good attitude, scores a fantastic goal, great finish. Um, you know, so all in all, very pleasing. You know, there's, we're going to have lads unhappy when they're not playing. But unfortunately, you know, that's that's the way football is. We can't all play. Mm. Neil, a huge psychological boost, isn't it, at this stage of the season, coming to a ground like this against a team that have done so well against the other teams around you? Yeah, we've, you've, you've got to come to these places and win. We knew today, you know, we'd ordinarily workshop probably would have been a get difficult game for Norwich, but, you know, from what I'm hearing, they've had the budget quite cons you know, significantly cut. You know, so they can look towards next year. So, I know that you're doing really well. You know, a bit similar to Skem last year. They keep winning games. Um, so, you know, we've got to keep winning games. You know, that was the difference last year. We were stuttering along, and um, hopefully, uh, is it 11 now? 10, 12, 11? I don't know. I just look at the next one and base going. We take it from there. But you know, lads have been lads have done really well. And you know, we knew today that most likely, looking on paper, although this, this league doesn't usually work on paper, that the other teams would um, would probably win. Um, and I'm sure the other teams thought that we may slip up here, um, given um, what, what Frickley have done to, to other teams that have come here. But uh, to our lads, we've been to Rush all this I believe is a difficult place to go. We've come here and we've put on you know, very, pre pre very professional performances. And now, obviously, Bursko, as you say, on Wednesday night. I mean, yeah. it's obviously going to give everybody a boost, isn't it, going to Chester on Wednesday after, on the back of this? It is, yeah. You know, we just got to keep knocking the games off. That's all you can do. And, 
what will be will be. We've just got to keep winning our games or, or, or trying to win our games. You know, if we were drawn here today, it wouldn't have been a catastrophe. But we've come here and won. We've set our store out to play a certain way. It's worked. Um, and now we go to Bersco on Wednesday and, and, and we try and win at home. You know, people again, you know, they're down, down at the bottom, so it's a different pressure. But, you know, they'll come, I'm sure, and play nice and open because, you know, they've got nothing to lose um, on our pitch. And, you know, they'll, they'll have a right goal us and we've got to be mentally tuned in. Um, you've seen today we've we've made changes to the team that won it. Um, so, you know, convincingly at Buxton, then, you know, I'm not saying, you know, we'll probably have changes again on Wednesday night. It's not about individuals, it's about what I believe is, is best for the team on any given day.